Welcome back everyone. It's time for another update video here. So I have gotten a little bit more work done since the last video. Um, I know I think I mentioned my last video is going to start getting ready to pour the water in the river. Um, I still haven't actually done that yet. I'm still waiting to order some materials for that and then I should be able to um, go ahead and, and get the water put in for the river scene. Um, I was also going to start on either the extension area or this other area over here next um, but I actually decided to to work on this area here so you should be able to see I've gotten this area here um, roughed in with the base scenery so I started off along here with just a um, cardboard lattice and then plaster paper on top um, newspaper soaked in plaster uh, a couple layers on top of that cardboard lattice and that kind of shape this hillside that I have here and I came in and painted it and put the um, you know turf and uh, tile grout and all the different uh, layers on top of that so here's just another shot looking this way and you can see here where it's a little bit steeper I did go ahead and carve in some rocks and paint those um, just to give it some variation so it sweeps around this way, the hill goes back up, and then this I just kind of filled in with some sculpt mold between the fascia and tracks along here, and then it ends over here. So now we have this area filled in, as well as the fascia painted black. So now you can kind of see what an overview of the whole thing will look like now that most of the, well, all the fascia that's up right now is painted black. So there's just a, a whole overview of what it looks like standing from outside the layout. So that's pretty much the only work I think I've gotten done since then, uh, since the last update video. So I was just finishing off this section in here and I got it blended into the existing scenery at each end. So that finishes off pretty much all the parts of the scenery that are in now so next stop is going to be that extension that I have to build out over by the engine servicing area um, so that'll be the next item to work on I just have this train running around here so another area I also have to work on is finish off that building that's behind right there and then there's going to be a small hill in this area here and I just have to fill that in along the back um, so that'll be it for all the base scenery and then like I mentioned I do have that extension area in the back there to fill in so I'll probably get started on that this week um, cutting some wood to build out the little shelf extension I'm probably gonna extend it uh, let me jump inside here and show you guys so I'm thinking right now of extending it out 12 inches from where it currently is. So I'm gonna come out at maybe a 45 degree angle out to 12 inches wide and then just go straight along. So this whole edge here will come out 12 inches and then it'll meet up with where the current bench work is there and then the facial will wrap around and meet it. So that'll just give me space to put more tracks in here for the engine servicing area that's gonna go here. I still have to put the cold tower in and. Uh, the diesel servicing is going to be on the right side here. Steam is going to be on the left. Um, so that's the, the current plan. So this is the next kind of area I have to work on. But everything else is looking pretty good for the most part. So I think that's just about it for this update. Um, thanks for watching, everyone. And I'll be back with more update videos in the future.